working out. Hi, yeah. Year in and year out, working out is the number one New Year's resolution. But why is it so hard to keep and what is all the fuss about? We're going to overthrow Jim to find out. Why do you think working out is always the number one New Year's resolution? Because it makes you feel better about yourself and everyone always wants to better themselves in the new year. People feel gross after the holidays, lots of travel and parties. I think people are always trying to better themselves and their bodies and it's just the easiest way. I mean, if you want to be a better you, then I guess it starts with looking better and working out. I just think people like a fresh start and want to feel good about themselves. I think it's because we as uh, humans want to be ambitious <laughs> during New Year's. Why do you think we have such a hard time keeping it? Because it's hard. <laughs> it's hard. You get sore. Uh, I think because it's a mental challenge as well as a physical challenge. I just think life gets in the way and unfortunately we live in New York where it's really cold out or rainy or gray that just kind of stops them from getting motivated and getting excited. Because we all have good intentions intentions, but the road to hell is paved with good intentions. <laughs> I know like in the past it's always been my New Year's resolution I haven't been able to keep up with it. Because it's an arbitrary time to make a commitment and people feel like they have to pick a resolution, but I don't think it really comes from the most genuine place. I don't know, life is hard. Naturally, we love to always gravitate towards food. I think most of us are emotional eaters. We have so many things that are yummy and they give a sensation. So you watch a commercial and you're like, mmm, that's good. A lot of people just want to like sit around and eat and working out is like the complete opposite of that. Personally, I don't find it hard to keep. So how do you keep yourself motivated? I love eating. I don't want to get fat. <laughs> <laughs> Vanity, maybe? I don't make resolutions, and that's why. I work out with my girlfriends. I just do new fun classes, and I make my friend Taylor come with me to all my classes. Once you get into a routine, you start feeling bad when you don't work out. I guess, yeah, you set goals for yourself, so if you want to end up looking like a certain type of person or have a certain body type, I guess, you have to work on it every day. It's, it's a process. You know, I didn't, I didn't get this body overnight. Yeah, Rome wasn't built in a day, and I think that's the... That's the mindset that you have to have. Baby steps. You got to crawl before you walk. You got to walk before you run. The outside doesn't so much matter. I think people too much get caught up in their physical appearance instead of their overall health. The change in my body and then just overthrow in general stand for what are you fighting for and all the stress relief. It's, it's all about just personal growth and, and living a healthier lifestyle. Life is about the falls, but it's about how many times you get up. So get up every time you slip, because we're going to slip. It's normal. And it's just putting in the time, and you got to do it when you're ready instead of people telling you to work out, you know? Have fun with it. If you're not having fun, you're not going to stick with it. Good luck, everyone, and their resolutions. <laughs> just dedicate yourself to it and keep going. So if you have a resolution, a goal, a theme, an intention, whatever you want to call it, you can do it. I believe in you. Thank you, Overthrow, and Happy New Year.